It's right there. I remember the picture. And one of those balconies is ours. Woo! We made it. Yes. They even saved the spot, a VIP spot for Tatanka. Very, very nice. Darby Mira, Juan de Tabuna Island. Pero en Portugal. We're just killing time here in, uh, in Mil Fontes because our room isn't ready yet. We have to wait about an hour. And we just left the motorcycle and started walking maybe two blocks where we found this beautiful beach. falling in love with every town that we stay in. The plan is one night in each town, maybe two. And we've extended our stays. We stayed three nights in, uh, in Porto. We stayed one night unplanned in Braga. And now we're here in uh, Villanova do Mil Fuentes. And we're just gonna stay here, it's too beautiful. I think Sagres and Faro are gonna be on the next adventure, guys. Porto Cobo is a village just north of us here in uh, Mil Fontes, about 20 kilometers away, 20 minutes. A must-see place by uh, Paolo. So we're gonna just head a little bit north from where we're staying, have breakfast, check out a couple beaches, and, uh, and just relax today. I hope you're enjoying the videos here in Portugal. Thank you for watching, and click subscribe and the like button if you like the videos. Oh, the sun, thank you. Hopefully these clouds pass, huh? We've been very lucky with the weather every single day here in Portugal, except for one day in Lobios when it rained after we checked in, so it was totally okay. Welcome to Porto Covo. Recommendation by my friend Paolo. We're here, buddy. First, let's find some breakfast and then the beautiful beaches that you mentioned to me. These are cool, huh, with the garage? Playa de Baño. It might be a different way to say it here in Portugal, but I, I can't say it. I'll just say Playa do Banjo. Playa de Baño. Look at this. Let's take a look at this lighthouse up ahead here and then we'll come back and go down to the beach. There's several beaches here. They're all hidden in these uh, coves. Oh, look at this. to this little cave here to the right.
Paolo, thank you so much for recommending visiting Porto Covo. What an amazing place. Thanks for watching, guys. Far the coolest beach I've ever been to. And when I say cool, it's the scenery and the water. But I just have to share with you how we got to this point here. We really can't go any further, but these are all beaches that keep going and going uh, past these rocks. Let me show you what, what you have to go through to reach all these little private beaches. This rock right here is pretty annoying because it has these little shells on them pretty sharp so let's see if I could not cut myself People behind me, they took the water out. I guess you can go through the water also, or through that cave. The cave was much cooler. Okay, <laughs> we have to go through here. Oh man, thank god I did all the special trains when I was a Navy SEAL in the Portuguese Army. Hi Florida Outdoor Adventures, hope you're well, keep adventuring. Thank God I had a little super box last night and a couple sagres so I could build up the energy for today to do this amazing hike. I think we're here. Yeah, that's where we came down the steps. Back to our original beach. Woo! Ok, ahora estamos utilizando la moto para el doble sentido que tiene el dual sport. <laughs> A little off-road here on the beaches. Let's see if we get that perfect view up here.
Playa Malhau. Next beach on our beach hopping tour. que estamos paseando por Portugal que vamos a ir, ponemos de aquí vale. este fue el que este fue el barco que lo montamos nosotros vamos a coger eso 